Chattanooga couple says they sold part of their property for a road widening project. But now years after the sale, someone else is putting up a sign there against the homeowner's wishes. Thanks for watching. I'm Josh Rowe. And I'm Latricia Thomas. Here you see the property. We're just feet away from the structure. You can see stacks of bricks and a plastic safety fence where a nearby homeowners association is putting up the sign. That's a couple now worries the project could lower the value of their property. New Channel 9's Mary Beth Mangrum takes a closer look at what the homeowner's rights are after they signed the dotted line. This is just one sign crews are building right off of Shallowford Road, welcoming drivers to the Drake Forest neighborhood. But for the people who own this home, they say that sign is too close. Our property was taken to be handed over to some third party. For Betsy and Shibu Samuel. August 10th of 2023 is when we got a phone call the night before that, hey, we want to put a sign up. But the very next morning when we woke up, we already had our land surveyed and staked. They say the city paid for a portion of their property to widen Shallowford Road in 2010. The property was procured by the city uh, for a state and a federal project combined. And uh, that was the reason it was for the benefit of the public in general. But now they say this piece of land is being used by the Drake Forest Homeowners Association which they aren't a part of. They did put a variant sign up here in August. We went to the meetings and both meetings were a waste. Other neighbors we talked with that have homes close to the sign say they were made aware and had no issue with the construction and told us a previous sign for the neighborhood did exist before the tornadoes in 2020. The previous sign was up in the middle. It was an arch and it said Drake Forest. We reached out to the Drake Forest HOA. They tell us this work is permitted through a building permit and all questions must be directed to the city attorney. A Chattanooga City spokesperson told us in a statement, quote, because the sign is on city property, the city's right of way and complies with zoning requirements for that public area, no special exception or variance was needed. From our understanding, they're saying it's a right away, so we have nothing to do with it. But the Samuels are still concerned with how this will affect the value of their property. So any sort of external obsolescence is going to affect your property value. In Chattanooga, Mary Beth Mangrum, News Channel 9.